Oh, it is not too late and really never too late to make a difference in the life of a homeless animal. Joining us this morning is Mike Yerge from the Greene County Humane Society who introduces us to Mo. Yes, Mo, maybe you remember six weeks ago or, or the viewers do, we brought Larry in. Well, Larry, Curly, and Mo all came to us together from a lady's oh, garage over in Broadhead. Right, right. And so, obviously, uh, Mo has been there for about seven weeks now, Aww. seven, eight weeks, and she is just a really neat dog. Yeah, you said this was the easiest dog you've ever had when because you take the pet of the week home with you the night before. Exactly. We took her home. We bathed. We bathed her. Give her a walk, and she was so unobtrusive. Barely knew, you know, we barely knew she was there Aww, when she had to do her business, as we say. She went to the door, gave us a little indication. You can't beat that for easy. No, so this obviously was somebody's pet. So, you know, this is this will be pretty much a user-friendly dog. Her coat, by the way, is so smooth. She's just got that wonderful feel. And when she looks at you, there's just like a little trusting look like, can I please go home with and, you And her now? tail starts wagging. As soon as, as, soon as yeah. she sees somebody come into the room, her tail starts wagging. You know, she's a Australian Shepherd mix, but doesn't have that Australian Shepherd energy that some people <laughs> fear. I called her slow mo Shen <laughs> this morning. But she, could be, she could be mosey, because that's about how she gets around. That's right. And Mo's about what, six to eight years old? Yeah, somewhere in there. She's got real good oh. teeth, you know, just a great attitude. You know, one Hi. thing, she's not shedding a bunch. We gave her a bath yesterday, and usually a, a thick-coated dog like this will shed like crazy after a bath. Just a really easy easy care dog and with the oh, yeah. weekend coming up what a better way with a three-day weekend to, to start and bring a new animal into your home I agree you've got a lot of time to spend with the dog just to bond with them and this is one who is ready and who deserves a good home oh absolutely she she was very much ready for a home last night Oh, you could just see she got right into the home environment like she was meant to be there. Absolutely, and uh, didn't you know what didn't want on the couch or on the bed wasn't oh, you know after every bit of food she could get. No, just really really easy. And it's just such a little when she when she looks over her shoulder at me, it's just that trusting little look. Please, please. So hopefully you will open up your heart and your home to Mo. Please go right to the morning show page, or you could also see, uh, let's see, news links as well, and uh, Green County Humane Society in Monroe. Thank you so much. We appreciate your time. Well, thanks for having us. Yeah. All right, Mo, sweetie, go get a home, okay? Don't run too fast. Don't, <laughs> don't strain yourself.